played seven at home, only four on the road. They're six and one in Seattle. And two and two away with a two-game winning streak coming in. There's Robinson underneath, powering it up and in, and it's fourth. And arrive and he misses. And McKee brings it up as Seattle looks for their first lead. And it's Kemp rejected by Robinson. Big ride up by Patio on offense tonight by the Spurs. Another tipped rebound saved Del Negro. Elliott, he's got Robinson ahead of the pack. Kemp able to penetrate. And he's sent back Robinson and Elliott, but he comes off to Peyton. Now that's the way Tarkanian would like to play it every night. We just have a kind of roster that Carl has. Robinson outside. Has six. Under George Carl. He likes guys like Askew who can play defense and handle the ball. Very athletic player. Robinson out quicking Benjamin and a three-point opportunity. That a tailor-made driving situation for the Admiral. Well, David beats Benjamin who can't get his foot over quick enough to, to stop Dave from getting the baseline. Of course, it was such a... 15 and a half. Spurs have matched the biggest lead of the night. Seven points. And they've held the Sonics to just 36 on 40 last night. Seven assists, six rebounds, five steals, no turnovers. Just about a perfect game. Robinson on the turn has third gauge, keeps it alive. Robinson makes a miss to follow. And Smith controls. Outlet is Ellis. Three on one. Robinson back to him, and he'll get the two. Kept pump faking to get that shot off. Robinson one on one against Cage. McKee came over too late. And he's got 15. Dave very got that jump shot, and so he gave it to him. And the Sonics changed their defensive matchups. Carr, that's goaltending on Kemp, who got way out of the game. And this now a 15 to 4 extended run by the Super Sonics. They fouled David putting a lot of pressure on Sean Elliott as the guy trying to throw the ball in on the post-ups. Derek McKee, bigger than Sean. Excellent defensive player when he wants to be. Robinson on the Elliott feed has 19. One falls for Peyton, who's up to 15. Both Peyton and Barrows here are creating, the Spurs are having to switch to stay with these guys. And they're getting back to these, uh, back to the shooting, to the guys that are in shooting position and scoring. The turnaround, Robinson. His third offensive rebound on that sequence will put him on. Really is. He's got great strength with his wrist. And it feels like he's got the distance. Looks like he's got the distance on every shot. It's just a matter of direction. Robinson drives on Benjamin, and they again send the Abbey. That time Pierce came off and got open, but as he got into the middle of the lane, kicked it out to Peyton for the jump shot. Larry Peyton, 8 out of 13 from the field. The Sonics up to 49%. Robinson, two more. That's 5 of 15 last night with a miss. Down to Eddie Johnson, throws it away. One pass too many. And Daniels makes up for it with a steal. Askew lost his footing. Robinson all the way. No. But he'll... Robinson. From behind, foul by Michael K. Looking for a shot with the clock down under five, and Elliott hits it. A tough lean in. For Robinson against the 6'9". Cage, two more, a season-high 30. Crowded out at the point by Peyton. Robinson double. Underneath, open man, Elliott for the three-point play. Great patience. Look on Peyton. Six on the shot clock to Robinson, wide open. 34, and they're up three again. Johnson, big miss, one and done. Long pass, down to David. Just able to get that one to David. Back to Sean. Running one-hander. No rebound. Cage stolen by Robinson. They wave off the shot. Two first, and boy, that was almost a totally unencumbered basket by Peyton to cut the lead to three. Now look for the Sonics to foul when they can, and they get David with 19. Ten seconds. Pierce. 
over Elliott, missed the two. Carr with the clinching rebound. Lloyd Daniels will dribble it out and feed the Admiral at the buzzer. Count it, and the Spurs win it by seven. On a 42.9.